happening today. Anti-abortion activists are taking to the streets for the annual March for Life in Washington, D.C. CBS 4's Willie James Inman is outside the Supreme Court with why this year's gathering is particularly significant. The annual March for Life is taking place for the first time since the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade. Protesters on both sides say the fight over rights is not over. It's just simply switch from the courts to Congress and state legislatures. Marchers are adding a stop this year, walking by the U.S. Capitol, where their abortion rights debate is ongoing. The only way to restore the protections uh, of Roe is for Congress to pass a national law codifying the right to choose. But with Congress divided, the most notable fights are taking place in the states. 22 states have already enacted full or partial abortion bans, although some of those have been struck down in the courts. On the other hand, 21 states have enshrined abortion rights into law. Willie James Inman, CBS News, Washington. And Vice President Kamala Harris will commemorate the 50th anniversary of Roe v. Wade with a speech right here on Florida that will take place on Sunday.